yes, the community streams will be much better. There's actually a lot of Twitch updates. There's a couple of moderator tools that are coming out, which look really good. Loot everything. Christmas is coming around quick. It is. Unfortunately, in my house, Christmas for us doesn't mean much when it comes to present wise because it. Oh, no, don't pick him up. Don't pick him up. No, I'll just put him down. Um. Oh, no! I can't loot him down there. Ah, uh, because mostly it's for, for Kiddo, right? She's the one that gets all the stuff. Hello, everybody. Oh, thanks, Sprite. But no. <laughs> Game share's good on the PlayStation, right? I think that's such a crazy thing that they do. You're on the Xbox One, yeah, same here. Sorry guys, um, oh shit no, no don't phone, don't phone, I'm just phoning someone randomly, yeah. Sorry, two seconds guys, my husband's just asked me to check something, I'll be right back. Okay, sorry, my husband's away at mountain biking and I think he had a slight moment of fear that he had forgot to close the garage. <laughs> he was like, can you check? And I was like, it's fine. It's closed, you locked it, it's alright, don't worry about it. Oh, hey Tetsu. <laughs> yeah, I got, the pro I got the hard copy of this, Will. Why do digital codes cost the same as hard copies? They can't be as expensive as you get nothing with them. It's the same, I feel like, with um, Kindle books. Like, I don't understand why they are a lot of the time more expensive than a hard copy. You actually don't have to produce anything. <laughs> Limited edition digital copies. <sighs> anyway. So we getting out of this hellhole? We're gonna try. Weather seems stable. And we just robbed a Leviticus Cornwall train. We got money in our pockets. The worst is behind us, gentlemen. So the question uh, is, where now? I know this country a little. I told you, we should set up camp in Horseshoe Overlook near Valentine. We'll be able to hide out there no problem, as long as we keep our noses clean. Well then, let's go. 
clean noses and everything else. Arthur, you're in that one. Bring Hosea. I know you two like to talk about the good old days and what's gone wrong with old Dutch. So what happened at Blackwater? Why did we have to leave? The only reason I like the digital copy. Wow, that's loud. For me, anyway. It's loud for me. The only reason I like the digital copy is if it's a game that I'm not 100% that I'm going to like it because I like the option to trade it back in. Because if I didn't like this, I would just trade it in and get Husband Dead PlayStation version. It's just my headphones in, that's fine. Turn them down a wee bit. Be good. Well, look at that view. The last of my birthday chocolates. Lenny, Micah, get over here. These are my favourite yes, chocolates. Just in case anyone wonders. Sure there's no surprises. We've had enough of those. I've Ain't ate two boxes this birthday. Just go. <laughs> Come on, kid. You can buy me a whiskey. Yay, the snow. It's gone. A dime piece. Nah, I've been conditioning my body for 33 years to consume this amount of chocolate sprite. Don't you worry about it. We are just fine and dandy. Get us out the stream. Gotta keep us moving, but calm. Well, fuck. Okay, let's take a look. You all right back there? Does everything look all right? You all right well, back there? The, the accents ah, are great. Broke the goddamn wheel. All right, let's get it fixed. You need help? I reckon we can handle it. All right, Charles, you and me. Hold on, I'm gonna eat my chocolate. Put the wheel back on, Arthur. You still strong enough to hold up a wig? Shut up. I'm just saying. I'll say less. That's some hefty strength he's got there. Nearly there. There. Brute force, that'll do it. You ain't so useless after all. <laughs> Not quite. Uh oh. think if they wanted trouble we wouldn't have seen them poor bastards we really screwed them over down here come on let's not push our luck what happened well get in I'll tell you Hello, suspicious dirt pile. Stay on this trail. We'll follow the river, then cut left inland. Can I do cinematic on this? So, yes. The Indians in these parts got sold a very raw deal. One handed. This is the heartlands we're going to. Good farming and grazing country. They lost it all. Stolen clean away from them, it was every blade of grass. Killed or herded up to the reservations in the middle of nowhere. How's that different from anywhere else? Well, maybe it's not. I just heard some of the army out here was particularly uh, unpleasant about it. Unpleasant? How do you rob and kill people pleasantly? We don't. In spite of that, just talk. I fear I was perhaps trying to simplify something more complicated for the benefit of our blockheaded driver here. Hey, don't blame it on me. Never forget, this here's a con man, Charles, born and bred. 
Just because it sounds fancy don't mean he knows a damn thing about what he's talking about. So, what happened to your tribe? I don't even know if I have one. At least, not that I can remember. My father was a colored man. He told me he lived with our people for a while. A number of free men did, but... When we were forced to move from our lands, the three of us fled. I was too young to really remember much. All my life I've been on the run. A couple years later, some soldiers captured my mother. Took her somewhere. We never saw her again. We drifted around. He was a very sad man, and the drink had a mean hold on him. Around 13, I just took off on my own. That was about the age we found young Arthur here. Maybe a little older. A wilder delinquent you never did see. But he learned fast. Not as fast as Marston, apparently. Wait, I don't understand. What's the problem between you two? Arthur? Uh, it's a long story. We still heading the right way? That depends. Are we still heading west in search of You're now hot, as is shown by the flashing sun icon. We plan? No. Are we heading in the Make sure you wear clothes appropriate. Desperate escape from the law eastwards down the mountains? Yes, I believe so. You know this area? A little. I've been How did I change my a couple of times? Pause. Is it in here? Nah. How do I change my clothes again? Do I need to maybe be somewhere to do it? Knock town, not too far from here, called Valentine. Cowboys, outlaws, working. Can't girls. remember. Our kind of place. The Driscolls. Probably them too. Pinkertons. <clears throat> Let's hope not. And this place we're going. Wait. What's it called again? Horseshoe Overlook. It's a good place to lie low. Do you even have other clothes? Maybe I don't. How low do you think Dutch is really going to lie? It's just, you know, maybe it's me who's changed, not him, but we kept telling him that fairy job didn't feel right. You and me had a real lead in Blackwater that could have worked out. Maybe. It just isn't like Dutch to lose his head like that. Things go wrong sometimes. People die. It's the way it is. Always has been. Me, you, Dutch. We've all been in this line of work a long time. And we're still here, so... Well, I figure we must have got it right a hell of a lot more than we got it wrong. What are you working on there, anyway? Just some yarrow and ginseng. Good for the health. Better than that stuff you buy in the store. Yeah, you can have all this. I'm at the point where I can do it with my eyes closed. Oh, okay. Thank you. You acquired some herbs. These can be consumed to replenish your cores. Yep. Why would I do this manually? It's just infuriating. When I can let the game do it for me. And I just get to enjoy the view. What nice horse's ass. I do feel like the, the 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 riding between places is very long. 
Like, I think when they're talking, you're meant to ride manually so you can listen to the conversation, but when they stop talking, you go to cinematic because there's nothing happening. Dog's licking his leg. Oh. Link, stop. He always licks his legs, he's a nightmare. His feet are never clean enough. yourself. There you are, brother. Head in there. Follow the track for a bit. Thanks. Hey, slow up. I'll jump on. Okay, let's go. Any trouble getting in here, Javier? Nope. It went well. This is a good spot. Excellent. I think this will work for us, Arthur. For now, anyway. This is nice looking. Very nice. Here we are, gentlemen. Home sweet home. So, gentlemen, no. we have survived. But now, now it is time to prosper. Arthur and I were about to prosper in Blackwater. We were onto something big. Then Micah got you all excited about that ferry, and here we are. We have all made mistakes over the years, Hosea. Every last one of us. But I kept us together, kept us alive, kept the nooses off our neck. I guess I'm just worried. I ain't got that long, Dutch. I, I want folks safe before I go. Me too. And now we are stuck east of the Grizzlies and out of money and a, a long way from our dream of virgin land in the West. I know, my brother, but we are safe. We make a bit of money here, then we move again, head out around them, be west of Uncle Sam, in a few months, buy some land. I hope so. Have some Would faith. You just look around you. This okay. world has its consolations. <laughs> Gentlemen, I'm going to head into the local town and, uh, you know, see if I can strike up a little business. Of course, Herr Strauss. I prefer robbing banks to usury. Seems more dignified somehow. Now, everyone, put your tools down for a moment. Come on, gather around. What kind of game is that, Will? I know that things have been tough. But we are safe now, and we are far too poor. So it is time for everyone to get to work. Get to work, but stay out of trouble. Remember, we are itinerant workers. Laid off when they shut down our factory to the north. Now get out there and see what you can find. Check this Uncle, guy with the top hat and the wee no more jumper that's too short. <laughs> it is time for everyone to earn their keep. There is a town a little way down the track named Valentine. Livestock town, all mud and morons, if I remember right. That seems a decent place to start. And, uh, we need food. Real food. That means every day. One of you. And remember, whatever it is that you find, oh. the camp gets to its upgrade the ammo food and other camp supplies. Now be sensible out there. Now the girls have your tent ready, Mr. Morgan. Come with me. I think it sounds, it sounds familiar now. Put you over here. Sure, everything will be fine, Miss Grimshaw. It should be. Most of your stuff from Blackwater got saved. Everything apart from my money. Oh, don't remind me. Well, we can always make more money. We're gonna have to. Miss Jackson, I've seen shit with more common sense than you <laughs> do it properly. Excellent. Uh, so hopefully this one will be better then. Tutorial done.
a couple of weeks later. We got off the mountain and rode east into some pretty enough country called the Heartland. We've been this far east in many a year. Dutch seems a little better. His eyes are sparkling once more, and I can see he's thinking a little clearer. I think we all feel a little happier, in spite of black water and that whole mess. Arthur? Jose? <laughs> Quite a day. Let's hope so. There's a bunch of the boys already in Valentine. Bill, Charles, and Javier. And Swanson found something down at the train station by the lake, apparently. And Strauss came back with that creepy little smile on his face. I'm sure there's a whole list of unfortunates he's forced money upon. <laughs> Thank you. And you? I'm gonna read a book. <laughs> Okay, there's loads more stuff on the map. Gams, gangs camp shown by a tent. So, map, that's fine. Complete within six minutes? What? Okay. Can we see the map now? Look at the size of this thing, holy balls. Okay, so what's the markers on here just now? Uncle, oh yeah, hold on. Uncle needs to speak to you. Reverend Swanson. Found something down at the train station by the lake. General store. Bring parts and animals to supply the camp. He can use the meat for food and skins to craft satchels with increased capacity. What's going on? Nothing. Nothing at all. For the first time in weeks. Nothing. We're free. We're free to plan our own futures once more. I hope so, Dutch. You kept the faith, Arthur. You always kept it. And I ain't losing it now. Morning, Arthur. Morning, darling. Oh, there he is there. I was like, where the hell is he? No. My life bumpers and triggers are all over the place. Ow! 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 Careful not to work yourself to death there, Uncle. I was thinking. Yeah, does it pay well? Oh, eventually. So, while the rest of us are busy stealing, killing, lying, fighting to try to survive, you get to think all day. Well, it's a strange world we live in, Arthur Morgan. Do you want to head into town? See if we can find anything out. Sure. I got some errands to run. Great. Go check the horses already. Just sitting there snoozing. Take the old man into town. Can take us too? Why, what you got planned? Nothing. We'll find something for y'all to do. We always do. We're bored out of our minds. Been cooped up here for two weeks now. Karen's about ready to murder Grimshaw. <laughs> well, can Miss Grimshaw spare you? <sighs> can Miss Grimshaw spare you? What's happened to you, Arthur? Three young, healthy women want you to take them a robin. and you're worried about house chores. Let's go. Fair enough. You got me. Come on, then. <laughs> I can't believe we're going to see civilization. Feels like weeks since we did. Yeah, Valentine. <laughs> Very embodiment to civilization. <laughs> Ladies are going to love it. 
Okay, then. Let's go. All right. Out through the trees here, then take a left. Go see what the town's like. back from over there, could you? From over there? I'd really appreciate the help. I I'm worried this one here will bolt on me too if I leave him. Sure, no problem. Thanks. It's the white one. There. Over there. That's it, boy. <laughs> this way. Come on. Nah, I don't need a lasso. We just be nice to the horse. He knows we won't hurt him. Plus, any time I don't have to lasso, I'm happy because I'm bad at it. Here. Here you go. You're a gentleman, sir. A gentleman. No, not really. I was just trying to impress the women. <laughs> well, anyway, thank you. Godmother there, Arthur. What's that supposed to mean? It means he got a heart. A small one, perhaps, hidden deep inside, but a real one. And you have it, your pulse bold lizard. Lizards have hearts. Well, Arthur, I'm proud of you. Oh, they just love me for it. Been here? I probably would have robbed him. <laughs> well, you did. <laughs> Hey Jack, how's it going? Woo! Smell those sheep! <laughs> or is that uncle? <laughs> oh, very funny. This looks like a decent little town. Other people. Finally. Look at Finally. that snow on the mountains. Sure don't want to be back up there. You think we should have asked Molly to come with us? Oh no. We all died, but we all had a good time. <laughs> Sounds like a good time. Or 
could do any real work. She's a society lady now. Go left here, down the main street. Dare's always on the right. Sure you can pick up some bounties there, Arthur. Heaven forbid you put your head on the line. <laughs> yeah, well, that's a young man's game. <laughs> Ooh, yes. We can I'm trying to get me some haggis any good. No, it's disgusting. Just remember, keep a low profile. Will you remember that though, Arthur? Probably not. Let's park up down the end there, near the stables. What the heck's the matter with you? 